So we're still looking at lines of symmetry. In my previous video, I've shown you some examples in real life of uh, lines of symmetry. Um, so make sure you've seen that video. Uh, otherwise, you go to my site, explainingmaths.com, where you'll find all my resources nicely organized. Now, I just want to very briefly have a look at squares and rectangles and their lines of symmetry, because students are, um, are confused about that. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to create um, a square. So very quickly going to cut that. This is what I usually do in front of the class, I'll do it in front of a video now, so you understand it too. So this is a square, and the question is how many lines of symmetry does it have, yeah? So where can I fold it that on both sides of that line it is identical? So the first one you already see, yeah, that diagonal, yeah? diagonus, yeah? from one angle to the other angle, that's a line of symmetry, yeah? But I have another one. Uh, going from the other angle and it's diagonal. Eh? So those are two lines of symmetry. Then we have the horizontal line of symmetry. Yeah, that will be three. And the vertical line of symmetry. As you can see, every time I fold it, both sides of the square are exactly on top of each other. Eh? That is a line of symmetry. It needs to be exactly on top of each other. Okay, so for, if I quickly sketch that without a ruler, for a square I have one, two, three, four lines of symmetry. Very good. And now for a rectangle, a lot of students think that also has four lines of symmetry because a rectangle has a horizontal line of symmetry, as you can see, yeah? The top is exactly on the bottom, so I'm already gonna sketch that one. That indeed is one line of symmetry. Then it has a vertical line of symmetry. There we go, where right goes exactly on the left side there we go so that is or those are two lines of symmetry but now those diagonals see what happens when i fold it diagonally yeah roughly is or are both sides exactly on top of each other so is the diagonal a line of symmetry as you can see no it's not what about the other diagonal diagonis uh, from one angle all the way to the other one. Is that a line of symmetry? No, it is not. So a rectangle, as you can see, because those diagonals are no lines of symmetry, because the sides are not exactly on top of each other, a rectangle has two lines of symmetry, while a square has four lines of symmetry. Okay, because those diagonals for a square are also lines of symmetry or mirror lines. Good. I hope that was useful. Like and share it if it was, because then I can help your friends too. Um, and go to my site, explainingmaths.com, where you will find all my resources nicely organized. Yeah? I wish you a very pleasant day, and go to my next video about planes of symmetry. And again, we're gonna have a look at a cube, yeah? because how many planes of symmetry does a cube have? I'll see you there.